homeopathy, alternative medicine welcomed by millions around the world. But does it actually work? The simple answer is no. Homeopathy was first introduced in the late 1700s by a German physicist, Samuel Hahnemann. Hahnemann believed a disease can be cured by giving extremely small amounts of substances that produce similar symptoms in healthy people when administered in large amounts. Like coffee, for instance, the stimulant keeps healthy people awake. But with homeopathy, it could help those with insomnia, but only if it's diluted to a minuscule amount. Basically, he thought the smaller the dose, the more powerful the effect. How can that be, you ask? Homeopaths believe that the water retains the memory of that substance, thus making it more potent. In his defense back in the day, the alternatives were purging, leeching, and bloodletting. <laughs> So we get it, but unfortunately homeopathy just doesn't quite cut it in the real world. The science says homeopathy is a fad. Earlier this year, Australia's top agency for medical research concluded that homeopathy has no medicinal effect on the body, and the National Institutes of Health say there is little evidence to support homeopathy as an effective treatment for any specific condition. Homeopaths might rebuttal with a belief that the treatment isn't harmful. Sure, it's all fun and games until somebody forgoes medical treatment for a serious illness like cancer for a more holistic approach. For more sound science, like us on Facebook or visit our website, acsh.org. Don't forget, while you're there, you can also sign up for your daily dose of news delivered straight to your inbox.